Hey, it's the Midnight Raven, and while sitting in my pyjamas on this lovely Sunday evening, we're going to be looking at Dress Lily, What's New In. So if you don't know who I am, I am the Midnight Raven. I am currently in my little flat during lockdown filming this video because if I don't film something soon, I might go crazy. I obviously can't film out and about, and the best I can do at the minute is to show you all these dress styles. Unfortunately, I can't go thrifting, which I would rather do, but we are just going to have to carry on with the video and see what we can do. So here today, we're going to look at Dress Lily and what's new in. If you want to check me out on Instagram, I am at the Midnight Raven, and the same with Twitter. If you want to like and subscribe and give me a big thumbs up, you can do. And if you want to comment down below your favorite item or whether you shop at Dress Lily, please feel free to chat in the comments. I do respond to every comment you leave. So let's take a look at what's new at Dress Lily. So this could be a variety of stuff at Dress Lily. It could be summer, it could be spring. We could be still seeing the end of Christmas. Um, this is the second week of January, so it could be a bit of both. So, okay, the first items we have are ripped jeans. Skinny jeans have always been a big thing, and I am going from lowest to highest in price. Obviously, on here, you can also change colours um, sometimes. Then we have some lingerie. We're not going to spend too much on lingerie because YouTube doesn't like that kind of thing. But you can see as I scroll over the kind of things that you can get. Next, we have this lace sheer lingerie set, which although it doesn't have a model in, it looks really cool. I love a monochrome. If you've seen all the clothes I generally wear on my videos, monochrome is usually the colour. Today, I am rocking my Coca-Cola pyjamas because I haven't got changed today. It's a Sunday. We're not going anywhere. I'm not getting dressed. <laughs> not getting dressed up. So next, we have striped cardigan. Not a fan of the colours, but stripes do look slimming on a person. Next, we're getting into crop style. Obviously, it's spring and summer. Crops are always in. And a nice white crop um, tie knot t-shirt is really fashionable. Next, in this middle part, we have this applique ribbed dress. Now, I've never had applique on a dress before. Um... But the kind of ribbedness in the middle as well is also kind of cute. We're also going to get swimwear. You've got like these polka dot ruffle swimwear. Swimwear is going to be a thing that's now coming. As you can see, we have lots of swimwear and sportswear. And we're getting into this whole summer beach body ready. Are you beach body ready? Have you sat on the couch the last year and then gone, oh my god, 2021, we're allowed on the beach? I gotta lose some flat. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Suddenly it's oh my god, need need to go to the gym. Oh no, wait a minute, they're closed. Don't even think about it. <laughs> you're gonna be on that beach whether you're saggy and flabby or thin and and lush, just so you can get out the house. Next we have these camo leggings. Never worn leggings myself. Um, is camo still in fashion? Um, obviously you'll get some one piece swimsuit as well, it's not always about being beach body bikini ready. One pieces are as classy as wearing a bikini, sometimes they even are more stylish. I think you get some really nice um, one piece styles as well. Um, next, we are looking at again some insert leggings and then in the middle we've got this ruched top. I like ruching because in the middle it can cover your tummy. As long as you're not too big a girl, if not the ruching then just makes you look bigger. I love this um, two-piece swimsuit on the side with the light peacock feathers. I love a teal or a turquoise. I don't know what it is now, but I am so turning to the teal side. Next we have more two-piece swimsuits. Some are obviously more flamboyant than others. I love this lacy top on the left hand side. This lacy insert off the shoulder scalloped top is really cool. And at £13, you get a bargain when you um shop at dress and you really do. Then we have some more kind of lingerie on the right with the garter sets. We'll just scroll past that. If you want to check out the lingerie, feel free to check out their website. Um, I'll leave the Wednesday link down below, but I won't sit here and look at laundry because YouTube doesn't like it. So, Next, I like this one on the right-hand side. This is the colour block dye. Obviously, it will probably come in multiple colours and sizes. 
see what else we're only literally looking at like a variety of stuff that like catches my eye this is really cool the plaid rouge bodycon dress now bodycon dresses are good for kind of all sizes if you're big and you want to hide something the ruching helps and if you're skinny the ruching can kind of emphasize your hips and that if you want to look a little bit more big um then you've got more two-piece swimsuits these are also quite cute on the left this cinch striped faux um kind of t-shirt with a kind of wrap top over the top of it kind of multi-layering because layering is so in and on the right you can't be a just true black bikini so slim fitting and black goes with everything as you well know on my channel i believe black goes with everything here we go this is really cute these spotty design spots have been in for years it's a fashion i don't know if it ever died but spots on um, swimsuits, it kind of draws your eye in. The idea they use spots on swimsuit is to create an optical illusion. So it draws your eye in, which then makes you look thinner. If you didn't know that, comment down below. And if you did, then I'm sorry if my intelligence and, and my, my information is boring. I, I, I like to spew some stuff sometimes. This is also kind of cool on the right this slip pocket long sleeve tunic i do like dresses sometimes that are literally do what they say on the tin a statement black dress you can never go wrong with black like i said goes with everything dress lily also do have a goth section on their website and in the middle here you will see one of their pieces this is the skull with um roses and kind of butterflies really cute is it roses or butterflies? They kind of look like butterflies at the top, but I think they're all roses. You've got these kind of two-tone multicolour going on. They do have a goth section. I do plan to do a review of that at some point as well. But at the minute, I am doing the what's new or what's in. This is really cool on the left. This wrap leaf insert. So you get the mesh part. So you're not showing too much um, flash off if you like to keep a bit of modesty. Um, so I do like the idea of that one, and I do love the palm leaves. Okay, let's see if we've got anything. Here we go. Tie-dye 2020. Is tie-dye still a thing in 2021, or are we bored now? That is the question. For £15.80, would you buy more tie-dye? Now, this is kind of cool. The one on the right here is another one from their goth section, and this is the Lace-Up 3D Galaxy Mesh. I love the fact that it's got the lace-up bits in the side. It pulls your waist in. So if you've had a very full Christmas, you'll know what I'm talking about. The one in the middle, again, the turquoise and the colour blocking. Colour blocking has been a thing for many years. And I think colour blocking can make an outfit really stand out, even though it's just one block of colour. If you do like this one is done, where you pop some lace in at the top and the bottom, you just break it up slightly. Oh, this is gorgeous. The one in the middle, this sweetheart lace corset. Can you imagine wearing one of these corset lace dresses for Valentine's? And it comes in a different colour. Does it come in black? Is it black? No. Okay. It's doing its own thing. It's doing its own thing. I was hoping it was going to come in black and it would just change the colour. But apparently you can't do that on this website. Oh, there you go. It's blue. Okay, oh, minty green. That is so cute. You'll have to excuse my son if you can hear him in the back. We are obviously on lockdown and the PlayStation has become his new right hand. This is also kind of cute. If you want something for work, you've got this collar with the top, kind of emphasizing the big collars and the big cuffs. Really cute. Um, pastels, obviously, have always been a thing. I think pastels will stick around for another year this is also kind of cute on the right here this scalloped edge butterfly um swimsuit and then you've just got a beautiful blue butterfly just to break up the black just to break it up a little bit really cool um i love the plaid on tops plaid really does emphasize like a black top as you can see on the left just a little bit of color and it it just changes a whole outfit the one in the middle is also one of the goth dresses they have. This is the lace-up faux leather insert. 
really cool you've got the little corset bit in the middle you've got the straps at the back it is to die for and i will be doing a review of the goth part of the website don't you worry i have that in the books um let's see what else we can get so if you haven't shopped at dress lily before i have i bought a load of stuff a year or two ago for my holiday and it was awesome i liked everything i bought didn't have complaints about anything i've also bought trousers i bought dresses i've bought tops um i bought so much stuff from dress lily and i intend to buy some more eventually once the budget from christmas kind of loosens up a little i plan to um so let's see what else we can find so like I said, the prices are not too bad. A swimsuit for £15 isn't a bad price. A top for £15, a shirt for £15. It's not a bad price. Here on the left we have this plaid snowflake dress left over from Christmas. They obviously will have some Christmas stock still left for the minute. These are also kind of cute. These boy shorts with the little cute polka dot top and the little scallop edges. Again swimwear is in but whether we're going to get to a beach this year who knows this is also kind of cute in the middle this plaid belted dress up you can also change the colors so if you are particular about colors you wear i.e like me you will find that this site has so many gorgeous dresses and i actually did a review recently about dress lily dresses and i will link that in the description below i did a review on all their new dresses they have in see this is really cute these dresses look really cute if they were just plain black they wouldn't look as good and then you put a pop of red or a pop of checkered or a pop of plaid and you change an entire outfit into something more um then they do obviously do sweatshirts in block colors you've got cheetah print orange and black here we go again this goth snowflake mesh panel vintage kind of 1960s but it's so cute with the mesh overlay and the green and then obviously you can get it in red which is great for christmas great for valentine's like i said all these kind of goth dresses they have here the purples and that i'm not going to spend too much time on them because i want to do a separate video on all that kind of stuff here you have some of the ruched um kind of leggings with the ringlet holes again only 17 pounds you can't beat the prices on some of these websites whether they're good quality i didn't find anything that i bought wasn't that bad obviously it's not going to be like massively good quality because you see you're not paying prices for that but this is really cute on the left the pussy bow black and white monochrome knitted dress is so cute i actually love the color black and white the bow the little ruching oh i am in love with this website if you want to support my um channel you can also go to my paypal down below and donate to the channel it helps me do mystery boxes hauls thrifting as little as a pound can help towards a video so my paypal is down below if you'd like to help my channel um this is really cool as well they do coats so you've got faux fur hooded coats for 23 faux fur coats for 28 um so we are getting up into the pricier items on the site and really we should possibly check out the most expensive item that is new at the minute so let's see if we can do that so if we go back down here it says we can sort it by so hopefully that means if we go to the most expensive item we can see what the most expensive thing new in is at the minute so the most expensive new in item right now on their website is for £15.60 and this is in the women's section Is this the most expensive? Yeah, £15.80 and we have this colour block top and that's what it says. It says that is the most expensive new thing in the women's section right now. So like I said, they are trying to 
trying to give you um, good value. Are the clothes good quality? I suppose you could say you get what you pay for with any um, website. The better, do you get more if you pay for more? The quality, I'm guessing you would do if you obviously pay for better quality. That's exactly what you're going to get. But I feel that the site, it does deliver. So this is what's new in the women's section. Obviously, there are hundreds of pages for you to look at in all different swimwear. You've got women's wear. You've got accessories. You've even got plus size. You've got goth. So if you want to check out their website, I'll link it down below. Like I said, if you want to help my channel, go to my PayPal and donate. It helps me fund the videos. It helps me do hauls. It helps me do mystery bags, mystery boxes, and more content for you. Obviously, during lockdown at the minute, it's hard to go out and currently my earnings are coming from eBay. So if you also want to shop at my eBay, link is down below as well. And I will see you very soon for another video. Take care and thanks for watching. Bye.